How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another pack opening and shuffles video with the Boston team. It's double mileage time, so I'm gonna be doing some special combos. Quite a few actually. So let's jump into some combos here. Oh we got one, two, three, four, five, six diamonds. That's that sucks. It's a solid card. Check out the skills. Nothing. Who's this poppin' guy? Never heard of him before. <clears throat> Alright, let's do some vintage combos. How many golds do I got? Enough for a few. Oh, this sucks so far. Although the odds of getting a diamond aren't great. Oh, let's go! That's a really nice card. Holy shit, that's probably crap. Oh, it's a decent grade increase. Wow. Okay, well, I guess maybe I will be using premium skill changes this week. I was planning on saving them for Team Select Sig Pack about a week from now is when I would expect that to drop, but I was not expecting to get a good team vintage from vintage combos. Oh, that's huge. That is a huge W. Rob Dibble. Never seen him before in this game. Um, how many golds? Just a couple of golds. Dave Spaghetti. Spaghetti. No skills. Okay, so time for a SIG combo. Yadier Molina. Um, I got a decent amount of stars. I guess maybe I don't really like doing a diamond. Well, maybe I can do one more two diamond silver combo. I mean, since I don't know. I mean, if if I get like a silver legend, I w I really won't care what what grade it is. Oh, and I got a nice uh, diamond out of that. One of the better pitchers in the game. Um, I guess I can do, I don't know, one or two more silver combos. Another Rigetti, okay.
still got lead silver packs. Oh, it would be nice to get a diamond. Okay, there we go. Justin Moore Noah. Well, it's not terrible for eight ultimate packs. Paulo Santana's having a pretty good season, I guess. Nice diamond. Joel Kelly, the legend himself. It's actually not even a, a terrible card. I have 80 left side, 80 location and velocity. It's a decent card, no skills though. All right, um, gonna check my backups because I'm almost positive I gotta have some uh, Valentines in backup. And I would really like to use, I'll check and see how many um, intermediate grade increases I have. I probably don't have very many on this account, to be honest. But it'd be nice to get a nice uh, head start on taking him to Black Diamond. That'd be pretty big. Okay, so looking for Valentin. Gotta have at least one, I'm almost positive. There's Petroselli, Dimaggio, Pet oh, Valentin. Okay, I think I do just have one. Well, it's not a whole lot, but it's better than nothing. And I don't have very many inter intermediate grade increases anyway, so... Oh, just two. So I would only be able to use one anyway, because I would have to keep the other one for an emergency. In case I get, like, 
a silver team sig or something like that. I can't remember how much experience this is, but it's definitely more than a silver card on normal. Six point seven percent. So it's basically the equivalent of looks like four black diamond pieces. So you've got one hundred ninety black diamond pieces. I'm not sure. I'll probably hold off until next week. Because assuming I don't get duped on the team select sig pack, I'd probably rather take that to Black Diamond. Actually, let me do some more combos. Should be able to do a few combos. <clears throat> Well, these combos have been kind of crappy pretty much all across the board in all my accounts this week so far it's like i'm getting like 80 percent golds back and when i get a diamond it's nothing uh to write home about it either nothing useful there even if i get a diamond well it's actually a team card but that's complete garbage so doesn't really matter. It's a decent pull holes, but not one of his best years. Unless it has a shitty grade increase. Alright, let's try to get some skills on this new Valentine. Wow, okay. Um, well, that's obviously I'm going to keep that at least in, in that skill slot. If I keep going, I'm going to choose the other st slot. Um, now the question is, will this card be better as is than, than my Bogarts with Slugger Spotlight Trading Junkie? Let me compare these two cards real quick. I mean, I think he has a better adjusted OVR because Bogarts has a bit higher fielding and that kind of takes away yeah so that's definitely going to favor valentine overall as far as uh base stats pretty similar grade increase too but look at all that uh eye that he's getting pretty much even except for a bit more eye his fielding should be okay. I mean, it's going to be like 82 in, in the lineup plus whatever I get for a train. Plus a couple more for Black Diamond. So he, he won't be terrible in, in the field.
I think I'm gonna keep going though. Although I, I don't know, I'm probably not gonna get much better. At least I don't have very good odds of getting better than Charisma Slugger with just 30 something skill change tickets. I don't know, I'll think about it. I'll use some premium skill change tickets and then make up my mind. Oh, I didn't even realize I have six of them this week. Okay, so I'm looking for ideally um pitchers cam and all the man I, I keep on forgetting that he's got a halfway decent skill set that I want to try out one of these days. Hmm. Okay, let me do the bath real quick. So I need 56 black diamond pieces to take Valentina. I might just take him to black and run premium skill changes on him. Because, you know, if... I was actually considering using some premium skill changes on Santo because if I get batters cam on him, I'd much rather have him on the bench and, and eventually put the SIG JD Martinez in the uh, lineup where he should be. He does have a charisma triple three on his other side. That's not a uh, batter's chemistry. I mean, that would be kind of like an eventual long-term goal, I guess. So let me do the math here. I usually farm about 35 black diamond pieces a week. I've got 190. So 160 is probably gonna go towards a SIG next week. You know what, let's do it. I can, I should be able to barely have enough a week from now to take a SIG to Black Diamond. Because I'll have about 30 something left over. Or no. 100 and, or about 125, 130, I think. Can't really do math right now for some reason. Yeah, so I'd have 134 left over, I believe, and that, that's that's going to be fine for next week. Getting pretty close to a legend skill change to get. Definitely not going to be this week. Oh, oh, got batter's chemistry. Uh, well, that's going to be a, um, definite long-term play, because as I was just saying with Ron Santo, I mean, this is even better. Because I'll, eventually when greens and blues come around, I'll put this card, assuming I actually hit something on JD Martinez, I'll, I'll be able to put this card on the bench. And put Sig JD Martinez in my lineup, which is going to be a pretty nice boost. So, wow, okay. Yes, sir, I will keep that. Thank you very much. That's not useful right now, but down the road, it's definitely going to be useful. Well, you know what? Since I just got that green, let me change JDM skill set right now. I've got one chance. Otherwise I gotta wait almost two more, well, a little more than two more months most likely.
Mm, nothing. That sucks. Well, I'm not going to be able to do that switch around for another couple months. But it's nice to have that stashed away on the bench. I mean, I can use that card as is with Charisma Slugger because there's two skill slots, obviously, so... Well, let's see if I can land, uh, imagine if I land, well, yeah, I, I, I guess I will roll on this card because I can always hold on to this skill set if I don't hit pitcher's gem or a absolutely insanely good skill set. So there's really no harm in doing this. Basically, fool's gold. Oh, it's with giant pressure. I don't want giant pressure. Although it'd probably be active quite quite often in this card. Hold on to nothing. So I guess I can just hold on to these skills. So since I have my uh, future batter's chemistry card all sorted out, I guess I can just keep on dumping premiums into Salamira and hopefully one of these days I'll get uh, pitchers come. That'd be fantastic. I'll check on this. I don't think there's anybody that could really use it. He's not going to be in the lineup for very long. If I had two of them, I'd probably risk using it on Buildy, but I don't even have... I don't think I have an OVR... Okay, I have two OVRM tickets. Okay, never mind. For some reason, I thought I didn't have any on this account. I must be thinking of a different account. So yeah, that was kind, that was kind of a decent W with uh, getting a a useful diamond vintage from combos and then actually landing batter's chem on like the first or second premium skill chains on him so that's going to be huge in the future uh thank you for watching bye